<laughs> Ooh, I crack myself up sometimes. What's right. up, everybody? So basically, I'm just going to be talking about how um, I saw this thing on Twitter and how this girl really thought, like, I don't know where her mind was going, but she really thought her man was going to stay with her. So basically, this is what she said. She said that she cannot wait for cuffing season, okay, because she's going to trap her man for the next for the next, well, basically his whole entire life. And I'm sitting here looking at the, the tweet like, okay. But then she, like, her other tweet that she made was like, because he needs, he needs to be responsible. I'm going to keep my man forever, forever, forever. And so I'm like, but if he ain't now, so why, what, what, what is, what are you doing? Like, exactly, like, what are you doing with yourself, like, putting yourself in that predicament when you know he ain't shit? If he ain't shit, he ain't, he ain't gonna be shit when he's a baby father. So basically, you just set yourself up for failure. And I think, <laughs> I think that it's so funny because there are people actually on Twitter agreeing with her. And I think that's just crazy. The fact that other females are agreeing with her to trap that man, they say your friends. <laughs> Those are not your friends. And you need to stop. You seriously do. And then basically, that got me thinking about other things people need to forget about in situations. I'm gonna give them to you. One. Oh my god. I cannot many times I've been told, I cannot believe how many times I've been told the fact that, um, some of you want to wipe up a whole. I'm always ready to stop going around and I'm, I'm, I'm going to wipe her up and I'm, I'm going to get with her. Like, don't do that. You're wasting your time, man. If a girl ain't going to stop now, she's not going to, she's not going to stop when you want her. Like, she's not going to, don't wait for her because she could be going on a long, long, long path. So just keep it moving, brother. Keep it moving, keep it moving, forget about it. Ladies, please, if you've been talking to the same dude for the past three to six, nine months, and you're talking about, oh, you know, we're in the talking phase, what what in the world are you talking for? Get some advice from me. He don't want you like that. If he do want you, he's being slow and you need to make a move. Other than that, forget about his ass. Oh, this is a big, big deal for me. If you're hanging around some negative ass people, and they're not doing anything but bring miserability into your life. Forget about them. Who needs them in your life? They're just going to drain you and make you not want to motivate you to do nothing. And let me tell you something else. If people talking ish out their mouth, confront them. And then forget about them. <laughs> because who needs those people either? Ain't got time for them. Oh, and another thing I think people need to forget about. Calling dudes ain't shit or fuck boys. Let me Had you not been fucking with the ones you've been fucking with, your ass would not be... With no fuck boy, you choose to be in that predicament. And since you're in that predicament, you're in it forever. Okay? And yeah, you know, so I will say sometimes we mess up a lot. You talking about some nah, but I love him. What you love? Cause you always call him a fuck boy anyway. Had you been done with fuck boys or ain't shit dudes, your ass would not be with another one. You would have found a better one. But since you haven't. <laughs> Your cycle's been the same, and you've been saying, F these fuck boys, they ain't shit. But yet, who's crying? You are. They're ignorant and don't want to try nothing new, and so all you're going to be with is with a fuck boy. And since you with a fuck boy, you're going to be a fuck girl. So you a fuck girl who like fuck boys. Ha! Done talking ish. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you guys will like, comment, and subscribe, and stay tuned for more. Okay.